Hello everyone, how all are you? I hope you all would be fit and fine. So today I have a very important topic that would be very impactful for your life. So I have, uh, I'm gonna discuss about the water because we are discussing about the importance of series. Uh, the synonym of importance it can be significance. So we are also discussing the significance of water which we have because we all know that uh, we have read everywhere that water is life because without water we cannot imagine the life of the human being as well of the animals and the yeah of course the tree we cannot imagine the life of anyone uh, so i have written some something here i hope you would all you all are getting this it's um, i think you i wish that you all know that uh, the chemical formula of water is h2o where h2 is denoting here for the two molecules of hydrogen and whereas one zero is denoting it's not zero sorry it's O which is denoting the one molecule of oxygen here so uh, let us uh, discuss some importance first of all then we will think about that if there is no water on earth then how the existence of life become possible in the on the earth so let's just uh, discuss first for uh, what for what we use water so for cooking we all know that uh, we uh, eat, uh, we have to eat something, uh, otherwise our stomach will not get uh, full or either we can say that we cannot be grow if we do not eat anything. So uh, it totally depends on the water, if we do not have water, we cannot make anything. And yeah, bathing, for bathing, everyone knows that for for taking bath, we, we must have to use the water for industrial and for industrial purpose, of course, we the the water is used for a, a amount for large amount and for cleaning everyone knows that at the home or at the pa, at the restaurant everywhere the water is used for cleaning the things the cleaning the floors the cleaning the utensils cleaning the clothes which are dirty and uh, what about drinking drinking yeah dr uh, water is drank by everyone uh, like here i have written some example like trees the trees cannot be grown without the water animal animal cannot live without water and the human beings as we are human beings so we cannot also live without the water and irrigation yeah irrigation as you all know that uh, the wheat the rice and the crops which are producing in the fields uh, which they are also based on the water and yeah uh, in industrial uh, what happens they just make soft drinks uh, the soft drinks are like the coca cola and the mango drinks some of the, these drinks can be considered as soft drink so these drinks are also prepared by the water if we do not have any water then how the rain would be possible and if there is no rain then how would be the formation of cloud will happen and there if there would be no cloud then how would the environment of the atmosphere of earth can be decided and if there is no atmosphere no environment then how uh, our earth can be existed in this universe so what is this is for everything or for everyone so now now let's just discuss about some of the uh, we can say the things if uh, there is no water then how would be our life uh, for example let's say uh, if it's summer and you are going somewhere outside and you do not have any uh, water and you are exhausting very much because uh, in the summer in the sunny days we want very much uh, we get very much dehydrated because of the sun's heating and if then we do not have any drop of water then how our condition get uh, become uh, we we become like uh, we get very much exhausted and we do not uh, able to even we do not able to talk to anyone even we do not able to work anymore because there is no water there is no energy in our body so what is this precious for everyone uh, 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 let's just take another example uh, for example if we do not have water uh, uh, in the sea so you all uh, know that what is sea the area the large part of area which has large amount of water the, that is called sea so if there is no sea no water then how the aquatic animals which live in the sea which live in the water they gonna do exist there they would get die uh, like us if we do not have water we also get die so if there would be no animal in the water like aquatic animal then how would be we us how would we able to exist because we all know that everyone not everyone but most of the people on the of the human being they just try to eat the aquatic things aquatic animals 
because we cannot give the proper uh, we can say we cannot give the proper pop total population the proper food as they want if they want uh, if we have uh, i think nowadays uh, the indian population is across 150 million and we have only 2% of land of whole earth of whole earth where the continent where the continent lies so if we have to feed the 150 million population then we have to grow lots of lots of lots of weeds and rice and everything and how would we able to produce these things on the earth uh, and if we are uh, for example suppose if we are getting to produce if we are going to produce uh, these uh, this much crop for the 150 million people only then what would happen with the rest of the people which are living on the other continents which are living on the other countries what would happen with them we cannot provide food to everyone so what would we have to do we can go for the another option and that another option can be the aquatic animals because aquatic animals just produce themselves in a very large quantity so we can we can eat them and we can make ourselves satisfied by uh, by taking those animals so this is the another a significance of having water uh, and if we if we will not have any water then what would we do of course there would be if uh, there is no water uh, if we think about practically or scientifically uh, for example in the future let's say we do not have any drop of water every every drop of water get exhausted or get vanished uh, suddenly from the earth so of course for that uh, what would our scientists do if uh, they would get time uh, they would try to manage or they would try to discover some new things uh, if, uh, if one can live without water uh, for example they can produce any capsule things because we all know that we have seen in the Doraemon cartoon that uh, if one ha uh, if, if one uh, get uh, if one eats the capsule then he or she might uh, get able to respire take breathe in the universe as well so it can happen in the future as well but nowadays this is not our scenario and nowadays there is no capsule of having the food or having the water like this so now we would have to be more but we can say that more motivated toward conserving our water because water is most precious if we do not uh, for instance uh, let's just suppose another thing if we have water but we do not have any clean water which is suitable for drinking then what would happen the condition would be the same uh, we would have to drink that dirty water and because of that dirty water many diseases will grow inside us and we would uh, eventually what would happen the all human beings the all animals would get die so it would be the very much dangerous or horrible end of the human being the society of human being or the animals or the existence of everything so be conservative uh, and be uh, do do not waste uh, do not waste uh, what much water surrounds you if you are if you are watching that someone in your locality is is uh, doing much waste water so you can say politely say to them just don't do that because water is very much precious precious and that's for today's video thank you for thank you so much i hope uh, you would implement these things in your life and you would consider these things for even a minute if you will do this i would think that my message to you get delivered and i will i would be very thankful to you yeah, thank you so much